back at it guys so here is the project we had to bring in irrigation an irrigation line and I, had, I didn't excavate right at the valve here but they had to there was a line here that it's a uh, horseshoe irrigation that's the the uh the guys that handle the irrigation water in Spring City. So they had to put a valve on here for us. And I excavated, got dug this trench. That's a two inch piece of conduit with power in it that I managed to snag because I didn't, I didn't blue stake, which is stupid, but there's rhyme to my, there's method to my madness there. And I thought that I was okay based off of trenches that someone else had dug in the wrong area previous to me doing this. So I was fixing their mistake uh, by digging the trench in the right area. And so I estimated where the lines would be based off of where they dug trenches. And I didn't estimate well. And that's what happened. So if you guys ever do this, make sure you blue stake don't do what I did. Anyways, we, uh, this is about a 400 foot line almost, um, that we had to dig. I swear, like, this is the most amazing soil here. There's a good foot and a half, two feet of just really good soil, and then it's clay. But in all this, I did not dig up a single rock. I was absolutely shocked. Looks like we have uh, some uh, Native American uh, uh, cliff art there from from Claire. Claire, look at the camera. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> So I got, I got this, I got a blue staked here. And so I didn't hit those lines, thank goodness. Those are, that's TV and, or uh, internet and, internet and phone line. But here we go. And so down here, we've got, This is our neighbors that I put in. And that's ours. The guy that that got us the supplies from Horseshoe, he's kind of an interesting dude. <laughs> what does he go by, Claire? Jungle. <laughs> he goes by Jungle. That's his that's his name. He goes by Jungle. And so Jungle, he bought a bunch of stuff. Oh, hey, look, it's dripping there. We need that tighter. Oh, I forgot to turn it off. Um, not dripping over there. Anyways, Jungle got us a bunch of parts and I'm like looking at this because I had it kind of figured out the way I would have done it. And based off of the parts that he got us, I'm like, what in the crap is this guy doing? Like, what is he? What? How is he setting this up? But it's actually pretty ingenious. So we've got this huge, like, three-inch line here, and then down there, he's got a he's got a T here, and then there's just a little screw-on cap down there. And so, if you want to extend beyond that, like another extend that three-inch line down there, you just unscrew it. You don't have to cut any pipe, and then you just you know add on to it. Same thing here. There's an inch and a half line right there. And it's three inch right here. And then we've got two spigots up here that go into a three quarter inch. And so we've got like two three inch lines we can tap into. We've got um, an inch and a half line we can tap into. Actually, we have two, two inch and a half lines we tap into. One three inch line we tap into. Here's a three inch. Down there is inch and a half. And because it, it reduces, it goes down to, it's got a female end in there. Uh, female adapter for an inch and a half and it's got a little plug down there and so 
Um, that's an inch and a half, it's about three feet down or so. That's about a foot and a half down, or maybe even two feet. And then we've got this right here where we can put some irrigation lines onto, and then three quarter inch right here. So I'm kind of like geeking out about this, like it's pretty cool. Some people, this is not very interesting at all, but like, you know, I dug the trench, Claire and I put the pipe together. It all held together. Big sense of accomplishment. This is pretty cool stuff. So anyways, that's it. Bye.